we are Avanti Heating and Cooling. We're making this short video in regards to the installation of the Halo LED, the new air purification technology by RGF, the makers of the Raimi Halo. So we are recognized contractors and installers by the RGF. So that's how so many of our customers has found us. And we have noticed a couple of errors on videos of installations of these devices, as well as some installations that we have come to service. And it is important to notice, uh, this is a variable speed unit. It is a system that we installed back in 2017. They had the regular halo and now they upgraded to the LED. Now it is important to mention that it is a variable speed system but because depending of the technology of the blower motor, it is the accessory that you use to install the LED. When installing the LED on a variable speed unit, the manufacturer requires to be installed using an air sensing switch because the blower blows anywhere from 30% up to 100%. So it is important to sense the air flowing through the blower in order to power up the LED light. Now in all installations, it is always required to install a transformer only and one transformer only for the LED. So we have the transformer and we wire according to the manufacturer specs with one leg going directly to the light and the other one going to their sensing switch. Now, for people asking uh, how do they know if the light is working, I will show you in a sec. But first, back to the reason that we're making this video, we seems some of the lights and some of the videos indicating as it is a 24 volt device, some people connected directly to the board, uh, to the terminals that power the 24 volts, not only will damage the unit, the actual board. The light might not be damaged, but the board will, and it is uh, not a cheap replacement. So that is a big no-no by the manufacturer. So as soon as the air sensing switch feels uh, any type of uh, air flowing through the blower, it will activate the switch and actually uh, light up the LED. The zone is opening, the unit is getting ready. I just don't want to pause the video and miss the mechanical sounds that it does when it comes on. So bear with me for a second. There it goes. I hope that you guys can hear it. And now you can see the indicator that the LED it is working right now. So this is the first visual way to see if the unit is working. Uh, if you have any doubts, uh, call your AC company. Uh, they can come and open this place. Uh, when you open this, you can actually uh, see if the light is working, but you will need uh, protection for your eyes um, Talking about that it is very important That this sticker is placed right next to the unit showing uh, the date of installation the recommended replacement date for the light and Also that it is important. You cannot look at the light directly or you will damage your eyes. All right um, Thank you for watching